What's up everybody, Miss Montana De Leon here. If the video is crappy, please forgive me. I was trying to find my camera. It took me 20 minutes to find my camera. Then I can't find my charger with the extra battery on it because this battery is going dead. And this is why it's so important that I go ahead with this minimalistic lifestyle that I'm doing. So if you guys don't know, I've been making a lot of changes in my life lately. This is another uh, goal in my self-love journey. So a minimalistic lifestyle, for the most part, is getting rid of clutter, getting rid of everything that you don't need or you don't use daily, and only having the absolute positive necessities and having very minimal, minimalistic, minimalist, minimal <laughs> items, only minimal items, and focusing more on putting your money in investments and putting your money in enjoying uh, the intangibles of life and just things like that so traveling more instead of buying makeup and buying clothes and just being able to, to do stuff and experience stuff and paying for skydiving lessons or parasailing or whatever so that's what I'm doing right now um, also I told you guys too that I've been on this thing where um, I was just following a lot of accounts on Instagram that were talking about cancerous things and people dying of this and dying of that and the government is poisoning poisoning us and there are so many like documentaries on Netflix that I was watching about how they handle the animals, how they kill them, how they're sick, how they're just all type of different stuff. Um, all the other stuff that they, they put in our foods, pesticides and GMOs and just everything was just like driving me crazy and I was like wow. Um, we're all gonna die so I remember I asked you guys in the last in a video or a couple of videos ago if you know somebody with cancer or know somebody who knows somebody that has cancer has died from cancer or just dealing with any kind of situation where cancer is involved um so I said I was gonna make a effort to do what I can to better my quality of life the way I live um, what I feed my kids and things like that so I'm going to just jump real quickly. Um, aluminum, I believe, is one of the big things in deodorant that we should stray away from. And it's linked to breast cancer. So our lymph nodes right here where, where we rub our deodorant, which Intel may help, you know, um, increase your chances of getting breast cancer. So um, hyperallergenic fragrance and paraben-free natural protection Crystal body deodorant lasts a year. Um, ingredients, potassium alum, which is a natural mineral salt. I got this from Whole Foods. I got this from Whole Foods. Probably like seven bucks. Another thing was the fluoride, which affects the penile brain. And you guys can reach, research all of this on YouTube, uh, Google, um, Himalayan. Botanic toothpaste, neem, pomegranate helps fight plaque, fluoride free, saturn free, sodium laurel sulfate free. So I got this from Whole Foods as well. And then I got um, a kid's Tom's berry flavored one for kids toothpaste. Tea tree therapy mouthwash with tea tree oil, natural fresh flavor, alcohol free. Um, ingredients, deionized water, sorbitol, tea, tea tree oil, natural mint flavor, citric acid, sodium citrate. I'm going to have to research even more when I'm picking out things like this to kind of make sure I'm getting the best I could possibly get because I'm not sure about this citric acid, sodium citrate, citrate. But this doesn't have any fluoride in it either. But tea tree oil um, has lots of great benefits, so I picked this up. And again, I'll be researching the mouthwash some more to get the best use out of it another thing I've been doing is oil pulling so I use coconut oil this one or the one that is like frozen well not frozen but like a like a lard type of thing I put some of this in my mouth I swish it around while I'm in the shower and the last thing I do while I'm in the shower is um brush my teeth after I finish oil pulling so I oil pull for about the whole while I'm in the shower like 15 minutes um and that helps to well just google oil pulling it'll tell you a lot about that it's 
a lot of benefits to that. Also, I use that as my lotion. I'm trying to stay away from the pink bottle Johnson's and Johnson's because of the ingredients on the back, but I still am kind of hooked to it. So I'll mix some Johnson's and Johnson's in there and use mostly that, but Johnson's and Johnson's for the smell. So I'm on the hunt right now for a natural, a natural lotion that has like that baby fresh scent smell. Um, organic wheatgrass, alkalizing and energizing raw plant, plant based nutrition, vegan, gluten, vegan free, I'm sorry, vegan, gluten free and raw. Um, it was cold pressed, if I'm not mistaken. And okay, vegan free gluten free. No, no, where is it? Why I picked this because of how it was processed. Um, but anyway, when you heat up veggies, you're losing all the important nutrients and enzymes and things that you want to um, get out of it. So this was cold pressed. I take a scoop of this every day with apple juice to kind of kill the wheatgrass taste it's not so bad i can deal with it um i'm okay with that um facial toner Whew. let's talk about facial toner apple cider vinegar specifically the one i use is the brads which has the mother in it i'm not sure what that is i have to research that but apple cider vinegar has tons and tons of benefits i do a shot of this every morning with agave nectar i put it in my tea actually um this yerba mate traditional tea I got this from Whole Foods as well. Um, in my mind, this tea keeps me with energy all throughout the day because I'm usually tired. I always need a nap. Probably lack of iron, lack of whatever it is that I need. Uh, but that has been helping me a lot. Oh, also, sometimes I pull, not oil pull, but the same idea of oil pulling with the wheatgrass. And I keep it in my mouth and I swish it around and I spit it out because... Um, it absorbs into the system that way like you notice how you'll put something in your mouth and you put it under the tongue for it to absorb faster it's kind of the same idea with this and then when I do take it to swallow in the morning I just keep it in my mouth for a little while and I let it absorb into my mouth absorb into my tongue under my tongue the size of my mouth throat whatever I let it absorb before I actually swallow it um yeah, the Yerba Make Tea, Google that. I like these. They do have them in can, cold, and then they have them in bottles, cold as well. So those are good too. Trace Mineral Tablets, the most powerful all-natural pH balancing trace mineral tablet in the world. Low sodium concentrate, concentrates trace minerals. Synergized with alpha, I'm sorry, alfalfa and kelp. Certified vegan, gluten-free. Um... This just puts the minerals back into your body that we sometimes are neglecting to get from our regular diets. Um, and I just take one of those a day. Fiber, raw fiber. I have an issue with getting a lot of fiber in. This is ugh, this thick. It doesn't have a taste though. So I take this in a bottled water. The scoop is like huge. Raw fiber, beyond organic fiber, excellent source of fiber, 15 raw organic superfoods. Supports bowel regularity and elimination of toxins. My second day using this, I don't know about it yet, but um, you can do your research on this. Fiber keeps you regular, gets you moving. Um, and then also, I'm going to start doing meal prepping and diets and things like that. So this is how big the scoop is. Right, that thing is huge. And it gets nice and thick if you don't put it in a whole bottle of water it's it really nice and thick last thing is the wheatgrass scoop just in comparison to show you how small that is yeah and i keep this in the freezer all right you guys so i'm going to cut this video short and next thing i'm going to be talking about is diet and working out at home and doing the most effective workouts where you get in working top and body at a time so you can minimize your workout time and then also corsetting I'm still corsetting. I'll put the link down below if you want a corset as well. But I'll see you in the next video. I'll talk to y'all later. Love some.